Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Now, have you ever wondered if your man actually likes going down on you or is he just doing it as a favor or he just feels obligated to do it even if he doesn't enjoy it because there are some men who just feel obligated to do it. Well, I'm going to show you the 13 signs to look at for that he likes going down on you. Now, if he displays any of the following um, 13 signs that I will be mentioning to you, then you can be rest assured that your man loves eating you out, okay? Number one, he tells you he enjoys eating you out. You pretty don't need much um, knowledge to keep watching this video if your partner tells you that, you know, he likes eating you out. What more do you need to know? If he says it to you that he loves eating you out, then he loves it. Number two, another obvious sign that he likes going down on you is that he asks us to do it without you even saying it to him. This may not always be the case, but chances are that you could tell from his tone of voice if going down does something for him or if he's just doing it out of obligation. If he can't seem to get enough of eating you out, it might just give him more pleasure than you actually realize. So, three, when he physically initiates it, then you know that he likes it. Because not every guy would initiate it, all right? Because sometimes body language speaks more than words. So if he spreads your thighs and he crawls or kneels between them without you indicating you want it, that's all the sign that you need to be confident that your man likes doing it to you. And you should be grateful for that. <laughs> Number four, if it makes him hard, like the mere thought of going down on you, girl, you are blessed because not all men like to go down. I'm telling you, not every man likes to go down. Some just feel like, oh, because she's giving me head, I need to give her. You know what I mean? They just spend less than five minutes and they're up. Because if they could pass up on it, they would. So does going down on you give him a raging hard on? That's definitely a good sign. Now, it's unlikely that any single thing makes him hard, all right? Because, I mean, yeah, it's a, a, a mix of activities and sensation. For example, at least you're partially naked, which is also arousing to begin with. So he definitely would be hard. But it's still a plus if he's rock solid just eating you out. Do you get what I mean? Number five, if it makes him calm, that's an even more compelling sign that he likes eating your pom pom and he's got to be incredibly turned on to come without any direct penile um, stimulation I mean what are we talking about that's a mad hold you have on that man because it's rare it's rare <laughs> number six if he does it even after sex that's another sign. Of course, it's a no-brainer that after sex, you might be a bit messy from your flutes and he is, you know, all mixed and messed up all over around you. But if that doesn't deter him from leaking your powerhouse until you scream again in pleasure, take note. Now, that's not super common. He likes it, girl. He likes it <laughs> and you should be proud. Number seven, if he texts or calls you about it, even at work, count yourself among the lucky ones if your partner is so turned on by the idea of just eating you out in the future or your past escapades that he brings it up. It's a sure sign, surefire sign that he loves going down on you. Number eight, if he takes his good time to pleasure you down there, then that's a sure sign because we can attest to the fact that when men don't like giving head, they don't spend much time there. They don't even spend more than five minutes sniffing you out like that. Mm -hmm. One, two, three leaks, they're just shoving them stick inside of you because eh? to them ain't nobody got time for all of that all right they just want to come and come nobody has time leaking you if they don't find any appeal leaking you so number nine sign to tell you that he likes going down if he likes to ask you how to be better a better eater 
a better header <laughs> then sis that's the one he's a learner and a learner is an excellent student but then again just because he would ask you how he can be a better conny linguist doesn't mean that he loves eating your pom pom he might feel like he has to and might as well do a good job of it but if any of the other items from which i have listed out um, applies to him as well then this is the one he may very well like performing oral on you so asking how to be better for you is one of the sure signs that he enjoys having you know sex with you he enjoys having to eat your pum pum number 10 this is my favorite if he moans with pleasure the whole time the whole time dance sister i'm already having you know my tummy rumbling thinking about this look Moaning is an easy way to tell if someone is enjoying themselves in and sometimes out of bed. You know, it's also pretty it's it's also pretty hot to hear. So if you could feel his moan or even feel you know the vibration of his moaning between your legs, he probably is having a good time down there, sister. He cannot be faking it if he's not liking it. Trust me. Tr Trust me on that one, mommy. Number 11. If you find out that he compliments your taste, your smell, or the appearance of your pum pum, that's a sure sign. There's, there's something so reassuring when your partner looks up, face slick with your juices, and then he tells you how good your coochie tastes or smells. Any self-consciousness that you might have had prior to that time would automatically melt right away. Cause that's a confidence booster. Knowing full well how insecure some women can be with their lady beats. So when a man tells you, I love the appearance of it, baby, just spread them. <laughs> spread them, let him come in. And number 12, he's determined to pleasure you like he likes it, all right? He likes eating that. So if it does seem like it's his personal goal to give you sexual pleasure, then this is one of a little iffy because it might be more about his self-esteem or being in competition with himself than you know, liking the physical act of giving you head. But it could be true that you know, he just loves eating you out. So hey, we, we, could, we could also count that into one of the signs that he loves eat, eating you out because if he doesn't like it, he wouldn't care much for your pleasure. Do you get what I mean? And lastly, which is the 13th, if he doesn't make you feel like you have to reciprocate, that's a true juicy pot eater whose aim is to please you <laughs> and and you need to thank god for such a king because he's a selfless one because i tell you some people view oral sex as an exchange rather than a selfless given act like this is always the case with men when they go down on your partner they want you to give them head and they even want you to stay down longer than they did with you or just because you've given them head they just want to have intercourse in exchange whether you liked it or not so because you've given them head they just feel obliged to give you head but a partner who doesn't expect or doesn't even let you return a favor really loves making you feel good and you should treat him good because that's a true king that's a true pum pum eater all right <laughs> all right then these are the 13 signs to figure out that he really really loves going down on you he really loves spending time on you and he's not just doing it you know out of obligation just because you did him a favor by giving him a head he's doing it because he wants to make you come through eating you out if you have that if you have those signs great all right if you don't have those signs don't think otherwise don't beat your head over it okay he might not just be an expressive one okay until i come your way again do stay blessed and i love you Mwah.